Disturbing new details and big pieces of evidence taking center stage right now in the trial of a man accused of killing two Van Buren County mothers. Junior Lee Beebe Jr. is accused of shooting and killing Amy Hensley and Tanya Howarth. 24 Hour News 8's Leon Hendricks has been covering every moment of this trial. He's live now with new developments. Leon? Emily, good afternoon. Today we learned that Amy Hensley may have been beaten be before she died. Karen Beebe, the suspect's mother, took the stand, and we saw a walkthrough of a huge mock-up of the scene of the shootings in court. Lots happening today in court, but first it was Karen Beebe on the stand for the second day. And the prosecutor clearly has questions about what she knew and when about what happened to those women. She got somewhat emotional toward the end of her testimony. I started to leave, but my truck got a little stuck on that little bit of an incline, right. and I asked Tanya to wait and come back and help me. Mm -hmm. And so she helped, well, you actually ended up pushing it out. I ended helped. up, yes, she got in the truck to drive it because of her back, right. and I pushed the truck up the little bit of incline and we got it to the road. Okay. And then she said goodbye and thank you, and that was the last time I saw Prosecutors also brought in this huge piece of evidence, a made-to-scale mock-up of the trailer where the shootings occurred. The prosecutor said he would use that to show that there's no way BB's story that he told police is true. The medical examiner, Stephen Cole, also took the stand and revealed that he thinks Hensley was beaten before she died. And are you able to draw any conclusions uh, from the nature of the wounds uh, as to whether those occurred prior to or at the time of death? Those were prior to death, clearly, because they're very red and consistent with a small amount of hemorrhage beneath them. Now the court is at lunch. What's been happening in the past few minutes is a bit of a back and forth. The prosecutor, the defense attorney both going in there, the prosecutor trying to show that there's no way what BB said happened, and the defense, of course, trying to present that, that uh, reasonable doubt, trying to show that Maybe this happened. Maybe that happened. The prosecutor, of course, working to debunk any of those theories. That will continue to happen, we expect, for the rest of the afternoon. We'll be here covering every moment of it and streaming the video live at woodtv.com. Reporting live outside of the Van Buren County Courthouse, Leon Hendricks, 24-Hour News 8.